Hello everyone. In a couple of weeks, I will be attending the Pony Club Championships in Lexington, Kentucky. I will be doing training level dressage there. This video is about my journey from the time that I qualified for the championship and all the things that have happened until today. So enjoy the video and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so yet. Everything started in January 2020 when we went to the regional dressage route. I rode Ray, the beautiful pony that I was leasing doing training level tests 1 and 2. I started Ride Red just three weeks before the dressage route, so we were training a lot during these weeks, but honestly, I didn't have many high expectations. My first ride was training level test 1. The ride was not the best, but not terrible, which was expected with such little preparation. We were both just trying to figure each other out. The second ride was test two, and that was the one that qualified for championships. Rhea was much more calm and relaxed, and I was more focused. We had better transitions and a much better performance overall, and that was enough to score higher than required to qualify. Back at home, we started to train as much as possible for the festival to be that July. I did training lessons with my instructor, watched a lot of training level dressage videos. I did a lot of practice by myself with Red to get her more in frame and relaxed during dressage. But then COVID-19 happened and we went into lockdown. The Pony Club Festival 2020 was canceled and whoever was qualified was invited for the next festival. I was a little frustrated, but I took it in the positive way that then I would have plenty of time to practice and get better with Rick. And because of the lockdown, I had plenty of time to practice by myself. And that was exactly what we did. Practice, practice, practice. 2021 came and horses started opening up again. The 2021 regional dressage rally was coming, but something pretty bad happened. Just four days before the rally, Rhea spooked during a dressage lesson and I had a pretty bad fall. I went to the emergency room two days after that. I still went to the rally, but I had to take painkillers before every ride just to be able to get through it. Rhea was very uncomfortable as well. During the rides, I was pretty much just trying to stay in the saddle, and I even forgot a step at some point. We got very low scores, but we were already qualified for the festival from the previous rally. The lease with Rhea ended a couple months after the rally, and I had no horse to ride for the festival. Luckily, I was offered to ride Luma, a very well-trained dressage mare. It was an amazing opportunity that I took, but also a very big challenge for me, as I needed to learn how to ride a very well-trained horse with a lot of buttons. I started to ride Lumina as much as I could, and we started to improve very quickly. I learned a lot in a very short period of time. We started doing local shows, and it was amazing. We started to win most of the shows, including the highest score in the junior division at Sweden, always being the youngest rider at training. Right now, we are refining details for the Pony Club Championship. So that was my story from qualifying in 2020 to the 2021 festival. I hope that you really enjoyed this video. And I'll see you at the festival. Bye-bye.